Hey guys, your boy Jack and I'm back with another video and today, if y'all cannot tell from the title of the video, I'm here with my 2023 room tour. So with that being said, two to the intro. You guys are helping me take one step to get to where I want to be and I, it's crazy. I, I love and I appreciate every single one of y'all. So if you guys cannot tell from the title of the video, I'm here with my 2023 room tour. And with that being said, this is going to be a little different than the ones that I've done previously because this is going to be my childhood home. With that said, I have been moving my stuff back home from my apartment since my lease ends in July. And this is basically my room tour because um, I'm going to be doing a lot of renovations in the near future because there's a lot of stuff that needs to be done in this room and yeah if you can't tell it's a mess right now like there's just stuff everywhere at the moment um, but I'm going to get things situated before I show you guys the room and this is gonna be what my room looks like right now like I said I wanted to do some renovations so stay tuned for that video because I want to do like a before and after so that's kind of why I'm making this video so I could see the before and then the after because there's a lot of things that I want to do in this room um, just to name a few things I want to get a new bed a new bed frame I have to repaint the walls I have to <laughs> find the closet door um, get a rug, get a dresser, um, get a new desk. Um, that's really it that I have for right now, but it's a lot that I need to do. And one, I don't have the funds, and then two, just the time, I guess, just taking it day by day. I'm just taking my time with it because I really want to make this my room because this is where I sleep, this is where I get my videos um, done, planning, editing, gaming like everything i need is in this room and i just want to make sure it's perfect to the way i like it as well with that being said um my walls are very very beat but basically there are a whole bunch of little small holes in the wall uh, big holes um yeah growing up you could say i had a lot of anger issues um probably back in the time it felt reasonable but growing up now it's like why the fuck did i do that um like for example like i think that hole right there I was mad at my dad because he was late to pick me up to practice. And I don't know, I think I was more scared of my coaches back then than my dad. So I was just scared of my coaches making me do laps. And I was frustrated. Yeah, very, very stupid. I was young and dumb. I did a lot of young, dumb things. Um, but yeah, that's, yeah. Another reason why you have a lot of little holes in the wall is because when I was younger, I had this little dart, but I didn't have a dark board dingy so I me and my friend just threw it against the wall and yeah there's a lot of little holes with that said my room has a lot of character um, but yeah when I first moved back home the first thing I needed to do was get all of the shit that my mom put in here out basically as soon as my sister and I left for college my mom took over our rooms and made it her closet or whatever and yeah, that was the first thing I needed to do was basically get rid of everything. Going back to what I said about what I want to get, um, I know I said I want a new bed frame and bed. The reason why I want a new bed, and this might make me sound like I am spoiled or being ungrateful or just um, bougie, uh, basically um, my mom has been letting her like friends stay over in my bed and using the covers and stuff like that and I just feel like it's unsanitary I know we washed and stuff like that it's just unsanitary um, that's one and then two is because um, a lot of the bed sheets pillows um, blankets were all hand downs from like my mom's friends so a lot of the pillows that we were using were yellow like yellow um, and a lot of the blankets and um, beds and like what we're we using beds like the bed I'm using was from like my parents friends and I remember it because we went to go pick it up from their house. I'm um, nothing wrong with reusing stuff. It's just I guess I, I'm a I guess I'm a clean freak. I'm a, a germaphobe. Um, I just want new stuff, especially if it's my room. Um, I might sound bougie. I might sound grateful, but yeah. And then with the bed frame, I just want a new bed frame because I want a cooler bed frame. I want to make one of those floating bed bed frames. So I want one of those. Um, so yeah. So there's just a lot of things that I want to do to the room. 
and I'm gonna bring you guys along on this journey because I'm definitely going to be having one of the videos where I redo my room or creating my dream room where you guys get a time lapse of me painting and stuff. And with that being said, I know this intro is very, very, very long and I know I probably rambled a little bit more than I needed to. Um, but with that being said, let's just get started with the room tour. All right, so it has been a couple hours since I've last filmed or basically since I filmed the intro. I filmed the intro like a couple hours ago just because no one was home and I didn't know when I would finish moving stuff around my room so I wanted to get my intro done before my parents got home so I didn't be too loud and disrupt them and stuff like that just in case it was too late um, but with that said uh, it's been a couple hours and I moved things around to where most things are going to stay for now um, things probably will change in the future and if they do um, you'll probably see it in the new update video when I do renovate this room uh, with that said, we are at the front entrance of the door and we're just going to walk right in and I'm going to close the door behind me just because, you know, so you guys can see the whole room and see how it is. Um, so this is just the first glance. I'm just going to do a quick spin. Um, yeah, this is the room. So to start things off, we're going to start in this back area where it's left to the door. And basically, we're going to start things off with like the bed, the bed's a hot mess right now. It's very messy and yeah, it's, yeah, messy. But yeah, this is what it looks like from back here. And like I said before earlier, I wanna make a new bed frame, like the folding bed and then put a new bed in it. And yeah, just don't mind the mattress topper on top of the bed. It's it's very yellow right now, but it is what it is. It's, it's a bed, I got a bed. I sleep comfortably, it feels good, it's nice, it's good. With that said, we got a whole bunch of junk on the bed that I need to move and fix. I'm um, gonna get to that eventually. And in the corner, we have a nightstand where I'm just gonna put random stuff, you know, same old, same old, just play by ear and fix it for now. Um, and just a little back history on the bed though. This bed has been all over the place in my room because when my first like room was designed by my parents, the bed was like back here. And then when I was old enough to move the room how I wanted to move it, I put it over here in between the windows. And then I put it in that corner and then I put it here where it is now. So this bed has been all over the place in my room as I have renovated this room. Not renovated, I have redone this room a lot as I've lived here for 22 years of my life, my whole life. Um, so yeah, I've, this is the same room I've lived in my whole life. Uh, with that said, moving on to this little TV stand next to my bed. This is what's going to be here for now as I do want to get something that's going to be better fit here as I feel like it's kind of like a waste of space as... I need more space to put storage. So with that said, this right here isn't doesn't give me a lot of space to put things. Um, so I was thinking about getting like a three by three and have that come up like same match that bed and just have more storage in there. Um, but yeah, just it's a whole bunch of stuff right there. It's a whole mix of things. I'm probably gonna put mostly like camera equipment there and just my like uh, diploma. Um, um, my football award, I might just put that there um, just to have it looking nice for now, but it's nothing set in stone. And then to the left, we have my uh, laundry basket. It's kind of weird because, like, if you open the door, it, like, it hits, but, like, it, it still opens and closed. But for now, that's probably where I'm going to have to put it just because there's nowhere else in this room to put it, like, unless I put it over there, but I feel like that's not a weird spot. I can't put it over there, like, you know what I'm saying? It's 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 in a weird spot. Um, so it's going to have to work there. Um, then we have this dresser here. Um, I want a new dresser because, not going to lie, I feel like, again, with this, I can get a better one that can have more storage because I have so much shit and I need more storage. Um, so we're going to have to make it work for now. But, yeah. On top of it, we've got other stuff. But we do have my diploma. You know what I'm saying? Big grad stuff. Got the belts behind there. And yeah, I got some pants and stuff there now, but I'm probably gonna have to move things out, change things around because this is definitely not the final layout. With that said, when it came to my shoes, my shoes was definitely the hardest part in my room because look, I have all them shoe boxes, I have this shoe rack, and then I still got my dress shoes, Crocs, those are Crocs in that bag. I got more shoes, more shoes, um, shoes. I just got so much fucking shoes. Um, so 
this is how it is now and what i'm thinking is with the shoes that i have left over are probably gonna have to go like down there and around here um yeah it's it's okay the one thing that really worries me of my shoes like this is am i really gonna wear them because it's gonna be a pain in the ass to go grab the boxes down there and then you know what i'm saying so it's definitely very very unique but for right now we're gonna make it work with how it is um definitely i feel like eventually we're gonna have to do something about it and whether that is make one of the extra rooms in my house a closet or move my setup into another room it's one or the other um but for right now this is how it is going to be moving on to the closet the closet used to have doors sliding doors on it but they kind of broke and they kind of just took up extra space um so i was just like why not just leave it open like this for now because it does open up the room in my opinion a little bit um and in the future i kind of do want a sliding mirror door so then that way i could have a mirror in my room um as well because you know there's no more space um i feel like i'm utilizing my space as best as i can um but with that said get a sliding mirror door and yes i have my closet color coordinated and i definitely have to go through it and do a spring it's not even spring. I have to do a summer clean out. Um, and let me know if you guys would be interested in that kind of video. But yeah, definitely have to clean out my closet. Because I do have to get rid of some clothes. Because I have a lot. With that said, here's my chair that has a whole bunch of clothes that I have to put up. Actually, these are my hoodies. Um, this is my dilemma. I have a lot of hoodies that are not going to fit on that hook that has 12 hooks. Because in my old room, if you guys remember, I had two I had two doors in that room because one was the bathroom, one was the main door, and I had the uh, hooks on both. And with that said, um, I had enough for both hoodies. But in this room, y'all can see, I only have one door that I could put that on. So I'm going to have to play around with that and maybe like make a custom hoodie hanger thingy. I don't know. Because as of right now, I don't know what I'm going to do with them. But the good thing is that it is summer and I'm able to just probably put them in the extra room for now until winter. But yeah. With that said, in my closet, we got the 2 by 3 in there that has socks, undergarments. Um, I'm probably going to put some shirts or sh pants, whatever in there. And then in the back, we got some storage. We got the suitcase in there. I, you, I don't think you can see it, but we're probably gonna put all these bags in that corner. On the other side, we have my rock band stuff where it's like the drums, the guitar, and we're probably gonna put the PS4 box back there. And yeah, with that said, it, I'm not too mad at it. It's pretty, pretty nice. Moving on to my desk. Don't mind that, that's very messy, but we got my PC to the right because it doesn't fit because you see those metal bars and then that is too short to have my PC sit on my desk. So my PC is in the corner next to the PS5 box and but my cord management is trash. I'm just glad like that's all y'all see. My cord management is so bad right now. But yeah, if you guys want me to do a full video on how I built my PC, let me know down below because my friend Deja helped me out. Huge shout out to her. And if you want me to get more info on the pc i could definitely sit down and do a video of how i built my pc and it's not even done yet because i do want to get a uh, elgato put into it but i just don't have the funds for it right now but eventually i'm gonna have an elgato on like put into that and then be connected to my ps5 switch whatever and we're just gonna start gaming and yeah with that said we have my pc with my keyboard mouse and then here's my monitor and i do want to get a double monitor so i can have two um screens and with that we got you know the plaque over there. Shout out to the plaque. Shout out to my cousin. Um, yeah, we got my plaque. And around the side, we have all my lanyards that I've accumulated over the years. And then we got my cords that I stole from my sister and my laid that I got from my senior graduation. And then up here, we have my, like, um, sugar, you know what I'm saying? Demon Slayer stuff, my pop figures, um, my Pokeballs, Legos, and then my Zanetsu that I'm eventually set up. But on top of that, we got my football helmets, and I had this set up like this in my old room, and I really liked it like this, so I'm not mad at that. Behind it, we still have my old posters and stuff like that. I didn't care to take them down yet. Um, I'll take them down eventually once I repaint this room, but just for now, I was just lazy. And let's talk about my fucking senior picture, bro. I know I've talked about it before, but I don't know in what video, but look at how they spelt my fucking name. Jackie Wong with the fucking E. 
If this was the JACK I eat, I wouldn't be mad. But what the fuck? I'm like Jakey. <sighs> yeah, my high school fucked me over. Um, over here is actually my first Falcons or sports game ever. It was against the Panthers. It was that game against the Panthers where we were down. Matt Ryan do a Hail Mary to Riley White. He caught it, and then we kicked the game when he fell a little. So that was that game. But me and my sister left early because we thought we lost uh, to beat traffic. But we won that game. But I was there. So, yeah, that's the game. Um, with that said, y'all should definitely go down, hit that subscribe button. You know what I'm saying? Got my nice 50-inch. You know what I'm saying? Telling y'all to subscribe to Jackie Wonger. So definitely subscribe. We got my 2 by 4 And, yeah, I thought it was a little cool thing to add my um, honor cords and stuff like that that I... That's the one I got from KSU, and those are the two ones that I found on the ground. But I was like, you know what? Let me get them as well because the yellow one or the gold is for honor students if you get a 3.5 and up. And the white one's a 4.0. And I found it. I was like, let me let me take it. You know what I'm saying? And over here, we have some stuffed animals. And yeah, on the left, we got my Xbox, PS4, the games that I have, and then my PS5. Something, something simple. Um, this is... Oh, shit, I almost just fell. Um, but this is how that side of the room looks. I'm really happy with the way it turned out. Because, one, I have all of this extra space to do other things. And, yeah, looks good. Over here, we got my ring light. Um, extra lighting. And like I said, if I do make the other room into my office, these will probably be set up in there already. As this will probably be there. Um, and that will probably just be set up already because we'll probably need lighting. So to start things off at the top, we have my like awards, I guess. As you can see, we got my Jackie Wong number 77, 11 year old Duluth Wildcats. Um, we got my congrats grad, my first place best trailer video. Um, and I think that's my eighth grade football award. And then here are my high school Jackie Wong, um, O-line MVP versus Collins Hill. And this one is O-line MVP versus Mountain View. We got my Falcons ball um, over here, which is pretty cool. You know what I'm saying? Go Falcons. Um, just other stuff down here. We just got all my random stuff that I have. Put those back here. Same here. You know what I'm saying? This We got my um, sports pops because um, up there we have my Demon Slayer pops. And down here we have... The Trey Young, Matt Ryan, LeBron, yeah. Other than that, we got my glasses and stuff. And then down here, we got like um, just random things. You know what I'm saying? It looks good. It's okay. It will do for now. In the future, I might get another stand, but who knows? Um, time will tell. Um. Oh, with that said, that's basically the room. We got a fan there. Um. That's really my room so with that said i don't want to make this video any longer than i really need it to be um but yeah that is my room um i probably forgot to mention that those are my like um graduation stuff my cap and gown not my cap but my gown with my suits my black and blue suit um they're just hanging there for right now I'm probably gonna move them to my closet soon to put up the hoodies um but with that said that's that's my room tour i probably didn't go into much details as i you probably wanted to just because a lot of things aren't set up the way i want to set up and yes i switched outfits um not gonna lie um I, it got hot so i took my shirt off and then it got cold so i put on long sleeve um so yeah but with that said this is my room for now there are a lot of things that i want to do to this room and there's a lot of things i want to get and add to this room as i feel like this room is going to be the room i'm gonna be staying in for a while because not gonna lie rent is too expensive so, y'all should definitely subscribe, watch my videos, you know what I'm saying? Help your boy out. But with that said, um, I'm going to stay at home, save money, and just work and grind from home for now. Or home at my parents and just save money. And plus, a big, big bonus of staying at home is that my parents be buying me food. So, I don't got to worry about that. Um, but huge shout out to my family um, for even, like, allowing me to do this and stuff like that. Um, but, yes, this is where you guys will be seeing a lot of content from for the upcoming future and there's definitely gonna be more things to come as i do want to take one of the extra rooms that we have like the office and make that into like a film room specifically and once i get that situated you guys will definitely see that but for now 
this room itself how it is right now for the most part is what you guys will be seeing in the future and like i said you guys should stay tuned because i do plan on doing a renovation room creating my dream room video as i do want to repaint it and get new things as i feel like i can elevate this room to make it better like i said i want to add a new bed bed frame um a mirror sliding door i want to add led lights repaint the room um get a rug get new furniture just a whole bunch of things i want to do in this room but like i said just right now i don't have the funds and also i want to make sure i get the right things that fit this room because i want to make sure it fits aesthetically pleasing as i feel like i have ocd and everything has to be perfect in my opinion but with that said that's my room tour i hope you guys enjoyed this video as this has definitely been a long video in my opinion because I felt like I rambled too much, but it is what it is. And with that being said, just let me know down below what other videos you guys want to see me do as I'm willing to try a whole bunch of different things. And with that being said, that's all I have for you guys. So subscribe, share your boys out.